This was another fucking failure. Welcome. How are you doing today? I'm really tired. My body doesn't feel great. I'm hungry. But I only have so many uh, daylight hours. And I gotta make use of them. So, one of my daytime running lights is out on my car. So I'm gonna try to pop one down in there. It's on the passenger side. So th there should be more room on that side for me to get my hands on down in there because stuff on the driver's side. I mean, my hands are fucking small, but it's it's tight down there. So today I've got a stoner rifle hat. I don't know what stoner rifle is, but I'll take a free hat when I can get one. And I'm going to be wearing one of my gardening gloves because you're not supposed to handle bulbs with like your hands your skin because there's like oils on your grubby little mitts that could like fuck up the bulb or so they say all right let's see what we got i don't know why i'm taking my glasses off is it as if it will help me see in there any better to take them off but hmm no, I think I am going to take them off. I don't know. I'm going to stick my face in there. Like, I don't want to make any risky moves. Wait a minute. These are not the bulbs that I need. And I could have fucking sworn that I did have the bulbs that I need. Because I bought them as a pair when I changed the running light on this side. And I remember at the time it was such a fucking pain in the ass that I was just like, Danielle, just fucking get it together and just replace bulbs right now instead of waiting for the other one to go out because it's gonna be an ordeal. And ultimately I went, <laughs> nah. Uh, and now I don't know what I did with that bulb. Let me check my trunk. We've got some fix-a-flat. We've got some cleaning wipes. We've got some leather wipes. Oh, these are probably very old. Oh my God, we got a can of tire shine. This is from when I got the car I drove in 2008. So I'm gonna throw it away. We have a book called Miracle Girl. I've never read it. Got a jack. We have some of this. We've got a pair of sunglasses that are just like mine, except they're toddler sized. In case I ever uh, run into or over somebody who's got a toddler with them. We've got some like wrenches and screwdrivers. There's a ribbon on this thing. I don't think I've ever used this before. The tool or the ribbon. Got me one of these guys. Got a little pink clip. We got a tape measure powerful. We've got a really dirty spoon, a pack of gum that expired in 2020. Only one single piece was eaten. I've got these jumper cables, you know, it's a smart move. You gotta have them. I've got this instant power charger. I've never used it, uh, but a good friend of mine gave it to me like back in like 2007 because he thought I needed it. Got some extra oil. Oh, and it looks to be expired. 18 January 10. So does that mean it expired in 2010 or 2018? And I also have this beer bong funnel. I got some more screwdrivers. I got this guy. Ooh, this giant cupcake. It is a gift box. I bought it for my sister. I saw this in the gift wrap section and I had to have it because I know my sister's birthday is in a couple of months, but I knew I could not wait because if I waited, it was going to be gone. And I need my sister to have this fucking gift box. I've got some film for like a, a Polaroid camera that I don't own and never have owned. I got my dad a Polaroid thing like a couple years ago for his birthday and I accidentally got him the wrong kind of film and he decided that he would just give the wrong film back to me even though it had been like opened and taken apart and it had been several months so I definitely couldn't return it. Well, fellas, this was an utter failure. Not sponsored. Use my code go fuck yourself for 10% off of your life expectancy. I want to thank you for listening. I feel like forgiveness is very important. So I want you to forgive yourself for the time that you have wasted watching this video. And have a good day.